Welcome to another episode of Passionpreneur TV. Today I'm here with Beth Feister from Eurovision Optical, one of my favorite places to go to see better. So thank you. Hi, Beth. Hi, how are you? I'm good. I've been to your store a few times yeah. because you are very involved in the community and have a lot of functions and open houses and different things going on. Yeah. And I appreciate that very much. So you're an optician. Mm -hmm. And what does that mean exactly? Uh, it means that I dispense glasses, I fill prescriptions, I make glasses on the premises, I test dyes, I do vision testing. But basically I can come to your store and zip in and zip out with a new pair of glasses within an hour? Pretty much. Either that or, or I will have them ready the next day or in the next couple of days. But most of the time you can have it in an hour, which is great. You have a wide selection in there? Wide selection of men and ladies frames, children's sunglasses, designer, budget. Very good. Yeah. Um, and why would I come to you per se than any other optician? Um, because I think my service is over and above uh, a lot of my competitors. I do a lot of extra things. I try to treat my customers like they were my family members. And I do hospital and home care visits for at no charge. And so I do a lot of extra things for the customers. You sure do. I will attest to that. <laughs> you go above and beyond for yeah. sure. So over the 29 years, have you noticed a change in the industry? There has been a real change in the industry. It's, it has gotten more difficult with online and cross-border shopping. And at the end of the day, I think if you have your customers at the forefront of it, people can see that. And, you know, I've really, I've been in Ocean Park now for 12 years. So it's worked out well for me. Yeah. Well, it's just because you're so lovely and Aww. wonderful to um, visit. And because some people go online and they just find their frames, whatever. Right. But they don't have somebody there working with them, working with no. their face shape. Where, I mean, the, no. the biggest thing I find when people order online is they order too small. The pupil distance is out, which is really important. The centers have to be aligned with your eyes. And that's difficult because you now are trying to be the optician. If you're looking for that kind of a budget, I also try to work within the realms of what you're looking for. So, What's the most important parts of what you provide? Obviously price. Price. I, I really listen to the customer. Um, I don't know how other people do. But the way I do it is when they come in, I direct them. I kind of say, okay, here are your you know, your metal frames, your plastic frames, your colors, and what do you want? And then I'll say, well, you know what, these are the things I see and the things that I think that you should have. Sort of try on, we'll try a whole bunch of different ones on. A person could come in, get a vision test, and then from there you can cut the lens. Right, if they meet the criteria of the vision test, they could, I can test their eyes. And um, yeah, I can make the glasses on site, which is really handy for the person because we're all so busy. And what do you love most about what you do? Hearing people's stories. Yeah? Yeah, people getting to know somebody because each person that comes in, I feel every day I wake up and I say, what, what am I going to learn from somebody today? You're very heavily involved in the community, yeah? Very heavily. Yeah. yeah. Which I re feel really passionately about. Um, somebody helped me many years ago, and, you know, it meant a lot to me. So I think when people don't have as much as maybe other people, I always think it's so nice. Somebody helped me, so I think it just goes full circle. Yeah, and, and do see Beth. She absolutely knows what she's doing and it's a really good time when you're in her presence she always can so make you laugh when you're feeling down or make you feel better when you're needing a little boost so yeah, yeah i really appreciate our friendship and uh and what you do for the community it's yeah. really quite special thank you yeah and i want to support you support beth Yay. and her journey <laughs> in your vision optical her store is in ocean park if you don't know where that is it's uh, in south surrey it's a cute little village community so definitely go and check that out and hit the beach while you're here so that's good you look like you're gonna cry oh, no. just because i'm being so sweet <laughs> you're yes. my gail she calls me the white rock i call oprah. her the oprah of white rock and i'm her 
Gail King. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> we'll start that right now. I love it. You're just waiting for your million dollars. Yeah. <laughs> so am I. <laughs> uh, thank you for tuning in to another episode of Passion Entrepreneur TV. If you are an entrepreneur and you would like to be on the show, please drop us a line. Otherwise, I encourage you to follow in your own heart's desire. And I'm Adara, and I dare you to be different. That's good. Good night, sweetheart. Well, it's time to go. Good night, sweetheart. Well, it's time to go. I hate to leave you, but I really must say, oh, good night, good night. sweetheart. Sweetheart. Good night. Good night.